Good evening, and welcome to another vlog. It's Sunday, February 28th, the last day of February, because it's not a leap year, 2021. And uh, a lot of stuff to cover, and like I said, I want to keep these short, so not a lot of time. So first of all, it was a big weekend of training. Uh, first and foremost, I did a two hour and 15 minute bike ride yesterday. Uh, did an hour and a half ride, followed by a 35 minute run today. Uh, which is called a brick in the triathlon world. So that means you do one exercise with no break that leads right into another one. So I did that um, because, like I said, the focus is the David Goggins Challenge coming up on Friday, uh, 10 p.m. Central Time. Uh, tomorrow I will have more information on how to follow. Uh, but if you go to www.goforthegoldie.com, just like it is in all my handles, that's G-O, the number four, the, T-H-E, Goldie, G-O-L-D-Y, um, you'll be able to, you'll see a little uh, write-up I did about it. You can click on that. It'll bring you right to the website if you'd like to donate. That'd be you know much appreciated because I really am putting myself through the ringer next weekend for this cause that I obviously strongly believe in. So it'll be cool. Uh, it'll be entertaining to follow me. I'm really going to lay out a really... Um, a really enticing thing to watch. You know, it's not going to be just, you know, GoPro footage of me running around because I wouldn't even want to watch that. That's stupid. But it's been a big weekend of training, and like I always like to do, let's head over and check out the workout today. So the workout today was um, not intense, a 0.72 intensity factor, which really doesn't mean it's a hard one. Uh, my my uh, functioning training threshold um, is 279, so that's this like it would be a line like right here. So you can see we trained well below it for most of it today. Um, average 190 for the entire hour and a half ish. Uh, so it wasn't that crazy, and I knew I had the uh, the run right afterwards. So it was more just getting that value in time on your feet off the bike. And uh, you know I actually did go at a pretty decent clip. I was at about a 658. Uh, mile, or I'm sorry, um, a six minute and 58 second um, mile uh, pace. So, you know, I, I did try to keep it around eight, but, you know, I was feeling good and those days seem to be not as often as they used to. So when you feel good, you kind of crank it. Uh, so that's it on the workout side of things. I wanted to share with you a funny story that happened this weekend. As you know, as a part of, you know, the many things that I have going on. I like magic. I'm learning magic. I'm learning tricks. I'm, you know, going to be posting them soon here, so stay tuned for that. But um, I, a new practice that I'm doing is I got a brand new GoPro, and what I like to do is when we go out, I always have cards on me, and I always like to, you know, engage with strangers. My fiance hates it, <laughs> but engage with strangers because they're going to be your harshest critics if the, if the trick sucks and they know it they're going to tell you you know then especially because i'm bothering them by walking up to them and you know forcing a trick on them <laughs> so um i walked into the bar on friday night and we were celebrating a friend's birthday we walk into the bar and look who it is that's right nope other way that's right <laughs> It's Ezekiel Elliott, and that is an actual photo that my friend took of him from that night. So I was like, oh my God, here we go. I'm going to have GoPro footage of me doing a magic trick to Zeke. I can't believe it. This is going to be freaking awesome. But I needed a little bit of liquid courage first. I was really, I'm really nervous doing tricks to anyone in the first place, let alone you know someone like that. Um, so... Wanted to get a little liquid courage going, <laughs> had a couple drinks, ready to go. He's gone. I blew my friggin' chance. Ah, that's okay. We'll have plenty more opportunities in the future to do magic tricks to famous people. But I thought that would have been pretty cool, but I was pretty upset myself that I didn't head over there when I first saw him. Obviously, I didn't want to bug the guy, but, um, you know, I thought it would have been kind of cool to do a magic trick to Zeke. But, hey, there's always next time. Zeke, if you ever hear this, I owe you a magic trick next time I see you. Um, last thing I want to go over really quick, we did an hour session today streaming uh, Super Mario Maker 2, kind of you know moving forward and, and climbing those world rankings. We're up to the 1400s and the 600s. 1400s nation, or I'm sorry, globally, and then we're in the 600s uh, in North America. And I, I wanted to show you this quick clip that I plucked from it as well today. I thought it was kind of cool, so I hope you enjoy it. But hey, 
Look at this, baby. We got we got a new capture card, so we're gold. How you doing, Lemmy? Things are good? Yeah, some of the tricks are just so simple, it's insane. So, I, uh... gonna run through them. I don't know, how do I beat them? Haha, <laughs> look at that. That's how you do. Let's go. I'm doing well, I mean, I'm doing well. Um, I'm happy I got this new capture card because it's working like a gem. And it was only like 45 bucks, so didn't break the bank. I don't have a good one. It's kind of like 4K thing. I spent a bunch of money on a GoPro because I got a big event coming on next week that I'm going to be doing all this stuff for. Another world record! Let's go! So I just thought you'd think that was funny. Just a little preview into what the streams are like when I play Super Mario. Unconventional way of beating Bowser for those who care and set a world record on that board uh, as well. So I thought it was a fun clip, but... That's it. It's Sunday night. Time to hit the ground running this week. We're going to have a big, big week. I have the David Goggins Challenge coming up on Friday. I'm going to reiterate that because I am terrified. It is a lot of not sleeping and a lot of running. Um, but obviously I wouldn't be doing it if I didn't think I could do it and it's going for a good cause. So, you know, I really appreciate it if you would subscribe to my YouTube channel. You know, if you enjoy this or you enjoy any of my antics and believe me, the hijinks will be getting crazier and crazier as time goes on, as the wheels start turning and I start learning better tricks and we keep climbing the you know world rankings and learning all kinds of stuff. So if you like this video, you know, subscribe. That'd be much appreciated. And um, that's about it. Just hit the ground running this week. That's the biggest bit of advice that I can tell you is Monday is coming no matter what, whether you like it or not. And it's how you react to things that you really aren't, you know, you just don't have that mindset that Mondays suck. It's just a day like any other day. Hit it hard. Hit it strong. Hit it fast. Keep grinding. Keep working hard. And, um, you know, we'll see you. We'll see you. It's, uh, it's a big week for me, and it's a big week for you. Let's go.